predictive relationship model. Predictive relationship model. As I told you, it describes the logical way in which the data must be stored in the database or in the, in the database. The logical way. And I'm a catcher, I'm not a catcher, I'll say. You cannot, only as you can see, when you finish school, you get jobs. And some of you are, are even putting up burdens. I don't think, sir, who's sorry, I now see, uh, Mason, come. I want to put up a building. No. I will say, your vision, the concept about the building, I will say to you, know, how many bedrooms do you want? Two bedrooms, or three bedrooms, or four bedrooms? How many halls? How many kitchen? How many, uh, I mean, uh, I mean, places of convenience, toilets and uh, washrooms do you actually need? Maybe now must be embedded. Do you need a wall? Do you need a garage? All of these things. Is it going to be a story building? Is it how many buildings? How many stories are you going to do? Is it going to be one story or two story or three story? You understand? Know all these things must be embedded. Must be given to a certain somebody called what? An architecture building architecture so that what you are conceived in your mind you understand you tell him and then he translates your conception into the reality on paper for you and then he tell you this time around even this time we have we have uh, we have computer aided design you understand they are also software they use it to nicely portray your idea the way you want the building to look like the flowering pot and whatever to look like on the paper for you so as you speak to him, he's also jotting some points. He's jotting some points. You understand? Now we'll be our summer in one week. One man will come out and say, hey, 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 of the way of the house and of the looking like. Sana database also today. We want to store data in a database. Now we need to also model it. So that's it. Now you will say, okay, and the way they can tell me way about collecting this data. Now we say soft schema and a schema also a DNA. You understand? How many schemas they make? You make five schemas, ten schemas, twenty schemas. It all boils down to all this. Now for um yeah the Amma somebody I have friend saying systems Analyst in a database model, a database designer. Who, who now idea? Maybe I said a business student. Remember, business students. Any idea? So, 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 develop a VCAC. Okay, a form of spreadsheet. You know. Oh, say, on one idea the conception. On the other the conception to the specialist. The specialist is a computer programmer. You understand? Who also in turn turn out to become the what? The systems what? Analyst. I don't think so. Sorry, yeah, no, I don't think so. Sorry, I don't think so. I don't think so. Everything was on paper. I said, we knew the type of code in that. I said, what is here? I hope you understand it. So, after we have model, they have a model. M O D E L S. Model. Okay? So, we are in the model. We are in the way of the model. Data. Alright? Like the way we want to store it. And I don't know if everybody in our core, what we call what? Entity relationship diagram. Entity table. Relationship. Who is it? You see, data now you store on the Data now you store on the wall. Data models on. Data now you store on the Each of the table you know, must have or a relationship. But there will be a relation. They can't a relation. Another table. Table deep back the fence and relation. You know, you will be sound deep and you will be Table deep back the fence and relation. And now, the fence and records. Okay? Records, real time data. Schema no, or sub schema no, the friend say topo, instance, values, records, right? Maybe tier two also. So, entity relationship model. Entity relationship um, model, entity relationship, here diagram, or here diagram, yes. Uh, data model is based on a perception of the real world that consists of a collection of basic objects called entities basic what object called what entities okay now we are doing code programming kakra you go you go to any an object in programming i have a real world i perceive program i will say real world or say you real it shouldn't be something um i have friend any real you can't program something which is not real okay now 
be a program. But for me, program, the people here can say, okay, we want to, we want to develop or program a car, or we want to program, we want to program a cat. You understand? I give the object here for the cat. And the one who say, I see a baby can say, okay, cat, no. Oh, is that or a meow? Meow, the small cat, the cat. Okay, okay. Now, who is that? There are other intermediate meows, but different boys. Okay, and you you will go say okay. And the man meow no, another the cat, the cat. Do we have any other cats? Are we related to them? Yes. You are a family of cats. See, you are a family of cats. See me. You are the lion. And your entity. Okay. You are another. Uh, your friends, uh, the puma is also a cat. You are. You uh, apart from puma, the sansu who are doing you. You are the jaguar. The jaguar. Or also a cat. And uh, you know, the lens, you are going to be almost a cat. You have a lens. Now, so, now, so, now, so, what? Now, so, and the big now, now, so, the big now, you have a shy, very shy uh, cat. So, you have a cat family. Now, some of you have a normal household cat. You understand? That's right. You have a cat. 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 They all come from a cat family. A cat what? Family. They are interrelated. And the term will be a person who will be a bit of a person who is called. A person will be a person who is a Entities are a year interrelated. Only care entities. Do you think that we can develop develop cat book? We get cat book now. We are going to take it to another person to have a hospital. Nous avons un peu de hôtel, nous avons un peu de l'université. Nous avons un peu de blessé, nous avons un peu de blessé, nous avons un peu de blessé. Nous avons un peu de blessé, nous avons un peu de blessé, nous avons un peu de blessé, nous avons un peu de blessé. Et nous avons un peu de blessé, c'est que nous avons un peu de blessé, 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 nous avons They don't come. They be a highness. You understand? Only when I a cat family. But remember, only when I a interrelated. Interrelated. It's the same way in the whole university. You were students. You were lecturers. You were prerequisites. You were data of records. You were dear view. She said, these are also what we call what? Only when I a interrelated. But I'm not here. Okay, so that is the program and what you see here. So you have to do program, you know, or be or be or be what that you know about your your data structures. Okay, that will program. We call your computer science. I will hold more data structures, etc. See, ah, but me and my colleagues, me are not here to teach you program, but me me only here diagram here. No, at at least as a junior, you free you free you free here diagram. But now as a we call your friend is saying programming. So if you can after you a year diagram, you can get the best thing for the year for normalization. But man, I'm not going to waste your time over there. Normalization, time is short. Okay? You see, you know, you have an entity relationship. Understanding the structure, okay, of the way a data now you have a store in the relation. If you have a natural R, you have a natural R into bracket A, B, C, D. Next, let's say, relation a, B, C, D. Remember, so many men will have to belong to the same entity, the same bigger picture entity. But my brother said, I am mixing no way. You can't mix the data of a cat to that of dogs to that. No, no, no. You have to be understand. You understand? So let's see the big picture like that. And you want the bank in here? Look at the look at the data they want to store. Customer, savings, and then current. So that's it. Right. So they are within the same thing. Right. So any relation diagram, data models is based on a perception of a real world that consists of a collection of basic objects. We 
vous dit object 1, student, object 2, course, object 3, maîtresse, object 4, department, object 5, you understand? Right. But then we now belong to the big picture entity called university. The big picture entity called hospital. The big picture entity called bank. Alright? Okay. End of relationship among those objects. Both objects. I don't know what you know. An entity is a thing or object in the real world that is distinguishable from other objects. For example, each person is an entity. And bank account can be considered as a what? As an entity. Okay, bank accounts can be considered as what? As entities. Accounts, man. Savings. They are entity. And okay, if you say, uh, your friends say, uh, current, and you entity. But they all, and our customers, they are entity. Now, but they all form under, they all form under what? They all form under the big brother umbrella called what? The bank. Right? Okay, let's continue. Each, and, sorry, entities are described in a database by a set of attributes. Entities have got what? Attributes, character, features. So entities are described. You understand? In the database as what? Attributes. So remember, what do we need to describe the attributes? The schema. The schema. You understand? What is the software? I don't mind to describe the attributes of the table we want to describe, we want to design. For example, attributes, accounts number, and a balance may describe one particular account in the bank. See, attributes, accounts number, and balance. Everything number, everything number is that one of the features of the accounts. It could be the savings accounts, and it could be the, uh, the current accounts. Whether it is savings or savings, uh, current accounts, we need accounts number of the customer, isn't it? And then the balance. Like the account, apart from any other attributes here, you know, we need a key in it. And they describe one particular account in the bank. And they form attributes of the accounts entity set. Similarly, attributes customer name, customer street address, customer city, may describe a customer what? Entity description. So attributes and you know. An extra attribute customer ID is used to uniquely identify the customer. Customer number no? is used to uniquely well, identify the customer number. Do the accounts number. Accounts number will be near here. The customer number. Simple. You give my customer number. Here's my accounts number. Accounts number no? is used to uniquely identify the customer. Since it may be possible to have two customers with the same address, street address, and city. Yes, of course. Until you see a mom, a unique uh, number. Okay. A unique customer identifier must be assigned to each customer. In the United States, many enterprises use social security number of a person. It's the same thing. In the United States, but I don't know Ghana. You understand? Okay. Government assigned to every person in the United States a customer identifier called the SSB. What more you have more in social security, for instance, social security number. What more payroll, you know, your government payroll. Do we say, who will say, um, we are identified uniquely by our social security number? Government, you know. But office now here, you know, so department, you know, so amount number, staff number. It's more staff number, all right? Okay. But government, you know, who will with the what? The SSB. Or that's the social security number. Okay, and now we are human by your. So it's the same thing. We are human by your social security number. We are human by the staff number. That is it. Okay. And a relationship is an association among several entities. As I told you, what I said in the student table room. Now you have five. We have what? Five tables, isn't it? Now also we have the independent. Yes, I go back here. Or some people in the room different departments. This officer will be a demand, this officer will be a demand. It means you need to recruit somebody in charge of students. You need to recruit somebody in charge of course administration and so forth. Oh, no, you're different. You understand? But in a relationship, in the database management system, you're a model, you're a model, and you're a one. I will say, make sure that all the files, if I, in our case, in five files, all the files must be related. We must, we must relate them. We must know each other. For example, a demonstrator relationship Associate a customer with each account that 
she has a difficult relationship. I was a bit of a woman, I was a customer, a customer table. I was seeing the relationship to either the savings account or the current account. You put the main database, your customer, but record next, I will not customer A, B, customer A, B, maybe a room. I will say you will let me to. When you buy a B account, I will say you will let me to. The, the 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 data that is in either the savings accounts or the current accounts. Remember, the bank again there. Any one of you, be a year ago, the two of them tell us now, the two of them, they are only keeping, they are only recording the customer data. We are here. No more saying, I'm not sure. I'm not linking it up. I'm not going to link you. It's already linked up. I'm not going to what type of account you want. Now we see this. No more details. No, I can't hold them. Like I said, it is related. Remember, I'm not going to design it. They made it possible say it was data or hand one, data or file A, also to people file B. The plan is unlike it means that they are related in one way or another. Very interesting. Very Okay. So the set of all entities of the same type and the set of all entities, all relationship. Of the same type, I termed an entity set and relationship set, res respectively. Okay, the set, the set of book I mathematics, book I elementary, Jesus, set A, set B, set C. Book I say, I am not moving the two together. Don't you relate them. Now, I don't have a intersection, isn't it? New union, other union set or intersection. Book I say, book I say, aha, this is also the mass. And the table will be to intersect or to relate the tables. We are going to borrow a little bit from the set squares. I'm here again, or zero session as a phone. Okay, and no principle that mathematics, you know, and I have been programming, say the way you are, data, you know, and as a table, you know, or the rules, or sorry, the relations or the relations, you know, meaning that we know each other. Okay, all right, so. We are or the Yanko a Yanko um aha Yanko table student. Also student number is a 17 for cement. And a student number A eight for uh if there is a brown. Okay. Yanko here the VA a student number. Mummy Yanko grade report. Also called grade reporter. On the student number 17 on SMEX, on the SMEX, but well one first meeting the Yamba, but the student number here. Area, but I have 17 web connection to which means that students number 17 are associated with what great reports. Student number 17 are associated with another you get with a session now, session as well. Okay, it was only being up here two times and I'm going to appear three times. But I'm going to have okay now. You say uh, great report now. So your session index. Session identification on called session number, both the session identification as well 85 92 102 112 119. That is on as well. Okay, now, what was that? You were 112. What's 112? Very good. Okay, it means that a uh, session so uh, you associated with what with the great report. Session, remember, is a table or a relation. Okay, you go to the 85. 85. I bet you great report. Which means that session so any great report in the entire team of our year, our association. Yeah, 92. 92 is over. 102. 102 is over. So it means that is a young grade. Young grade. Do you have any grade somewhere? Uh, no, there's no grade. It's grade also 14, 12, 10, and so forth. And also ever. So you see, so far as this table is concerned, so far as this table is concerned, um, hello.